This surprising video of a black Alabama mayor being punched in the face is shocking a community. The man arrested for throwing the punch, a white city councilman. On Wednesday, Tarrant police officials releasing video of the attack appearing to show Councilman John Thomas Bryant hit Mayor Wayman Newton in the parking lot after a council meeting. Officials saying the incident took place in front of witnesses, including the Tarrant police chief. Officers placed Bryant under arrest at the scene. Moments before the violence, this council meeting showing tense moments between the two leaders. I disagree with everything you said. Everything you said is erroneous. Their arguments escalating. It, uh, no, I'm talking, I'm talking. If a police officer would tell you the truth about it. Mayor Newton telling NBC News in part, Tommy Bryant is a self-proclaimed racist who has been determined to harm my administration and our city, adding, Bryant has no business serving as a public official in our state. Councilman Bryant did not return NBC's request for comment. And this is not the first time the men have been in the news. In July 2021, Bryant faced serious backlash after he used the N-word when referring to a councilwoman at a meeting. Do we have a house in here? Yeah, yeah. Okay. In an interview with NBC affiliate WVTM at the time, Bryant stood by using the word, saying he was repeating language the mayor used. I thought that the city ought to know what kind of terminology the mayor uses, and I didn't want him to get away with it. So that's the reason I made that, that comment. Many in the community pressuring him to resign. What a lot of the public's definition is, I might be a racist, but according to what the true meaning of a racist is, absolutely not. One month after that scandal, Mayor Newton was arrested on a harassing communication charge, allegedly using obscene language toward Bryant and his wife. This according to charging documents obtained by NBC Birmingham. A court found him not guilty, a point he emphasized publicly at this week's meeting. You remember we had a trial, a full blown out trial, and I was found not guilty you by a judge. Police saying Councilman Bryant is facing charges of assault in the third degree for punching Mayor Newton. All right, Stephen Romo joins us now live here on Top Story. So, Stephen, you know, we both worked in local news, covered a lot of city council meetings. Yeah. I've never seen anything like that or a history like that. Remind our viewers again where this is in Alabama. And I know you have an update on, on the councilman and what's happening with him. Yeah, this is Tarrant City, Alabama. Birmingham's probably the largest city people will be familiar with there. The Bryant, the Mr. The Mr. Bryant, the councilman in this situation, he did make his $1,000 bond. We talked to the police chief earlier. He said there's actually another charge for him. Another warrant that's issued for his arrest on Wednesday, just yesterday, because he took his vehicle from the impound lot without paying the fee. So now he's being charged with theft of services, something else that's going to have to come from this situation at city council. But you saw the fireworks flying, so can only imagine what's... And how is the mayor doing? Was he injured? Yeah, I uh, exchanged some emails with the mayor a bit earlier. It didn't seem like he mentioned anything about being injured, but obviously he's very fired up about the situation, saying that Councilman Bryant should not be in a position of public service at all. Yeah, he got hit pretty hard with that fist yeah. or hand, whatever it was. All right, Stephen Romo, thank you for that. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.